we got this baby powder and what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it on the hood of the car and we're gonna invite any children that have been seen running up and down this road to come and touch my truck why did you follow me home Dude. There's no bags. No, no, something. There's no bags. Something just grabbed my head. <laughs> There's no. Oh! What? <laughs> Katie, just outside of Las Vegas, Nevada, sits the semi abandoned town of Good Springs. This town is said to be haunted by many ghosts, from murder victims former residents to spirits of children who will manifest themselves as you're driving past the cemetery at night. Good Springs was once the heart of the most productive mining districts in Clark County and over the years lead, silver, copper, zinc and gold have all been mined from this area. This small town also houses the world's famous Pioneer Saloon. This saloon is considered to be one of the oldest standing saloons in the state, being over 100 years old. This small town has seen its fair share of deaths, and with that comes restless souls that haunt both the saloon and the town cemetery that sits nearby. So it's no wonder that this place has attracted so many ghost hunters to explore the area. And just like them, Tonight, Katie and I decided oh, to happened? go explore the rumors of this haunted town by focusing on the cemetery. Ew. What happened? Oh, something just like, like felt like it kicked me in my gut. We Are had you? no idea what we were about to encounter and how physically and emotionally it would hurt Katie to the point that it caused her physical harm. For the first time ever, we had to depend on spiritual protection to help from the angry and negative energy we encountered at this cemetery. We hope you enjoy this video and as always, if you see something we missed during the editing, please let us know in the comments below. But for now, turn off your lights, sit back, relax, and enjoy. What's up guys, it's Cryptid Hunter and I'm with my friend Katie. We're out here now on location at Good Spring Cemetery. As you guys just learned through the intro, this is the area where a lot of hauntings have happened. It's one of the most haunted cemeteries near Las Vegas, Nevada. And today we're gonna be out here trying to see if we can communicate with any spirit that wants to communicate with us. As I told you before, there are children buried here there are people, there are veterans, there are also a lot of uh, Native Americans that are said to be buried just outside of the cemetery. So a lot of people have reported seeing sightings of kids running through these roads at night. I personally have experienced an attachment that I believe came from this cemetery. So hopefully tonight I will be able to communicate with that spirit or attachment and find out why the heck has been attached to me. Maybe we can get some answers. I'm not gonna lie, I'm just a little bit nervous because yeah. this is the first time or the first cemetery where I saw my first full body apparition come out of the ground and get sucked right back in. It stood right in front of me. So we'll see if maybe we can get some results out of uh, tonight's investigation. You ready? Of course. All right, so one of the things that I'm gonna do tonight something a little different and I haven't tried before is we got this baby powder and what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it on the hood of the car and we're gonna invite any children that have been seen running up and down this road to come and touch my truck the truck was just washed a couple hours ago so there are no handprints nothing on the car so if we come back after an investigation hopefully we can see some handprints on here If there are any spirits in the cemetery or any of you kids that are seen on the road and you want to come and let us know that you're here, feel free to come and touch my truck. Just put your handprints on the top of this truck. I think we'll be able to see it. 
<laughs> well, yeah, but I mean, if they're babies, you know. Little kids, yeah. Yeah. So. All right. If there are any children that are in this area that are still playing around and you don't know where you are, if you need any kind of help, or if you feel playful and you want to touch my truck, please feel free to touch it, okay? I'll be back in a little bit and see if we can find any handprints. Have fun. All right, so we became a little bit separated, but Katie says she heard something. What, what happened? I was standing right there looking at the cross, and all of a sudden I heard a giggle, and I thought it was you. Where do you think the giggle came from? Like what area? Right where I was standing, right here. Show me where. I was standing, because you were right there. This, this is while I was checking the baby stem plot? Yeah, I was standing right here, and I leaned over to see and then you were right right here, yeah. and I was looking over, and all of a sudden I heard a giggle. Huh. Yeah, and I thought it was you. Mm. No, it wasn't me. Well, I was over here checking out this baby plot. Right here. That's a plot of a baby who died. He's buried here. So that he came from this area, you think? Came from... Right, right in this general area. You know what's funny? The last time we were here... This is the exact area where the kids were playing with us. Uh -huh. They were touching my other friend and they were pulling our shirts and everything. Mm -hmm. Right right here, right in this area. So, Seriously? Yep. So we got some uh, good responses with the ghost box. So maybe we should take it out and yeah, see what we get. I was just going to say that. Maybe we should. Alright, so because this is the area where uh, last time we were getting some good reports responses out of this spot we're gonna go ahead and try and see if we can get anything through the ghost box hopefully the microphone's picking up the ghost box okay you hear it what it just keeps stopping i don't know why it shouldn't it just should just sweep continuously okay let me pull this i don't know if this has anything to do with it i doubt it I don't know. all right <gasps> what was that it, something you heard it, it. it sounded heard like it. a sounded like a little kid Again. <gasps> what was that? It, something you heard like, it. It sounded like, like a... sounded like a little kid. Again. <gasps> what was that? It, something you heard like, it. It sounded like, like a... Sounded like a little kid. Again. <gasps> We're already getting responses. We didn't know what that, what that was. So I'm going to replay it. You heard that? I heard it. So I'm going to replay it. You guys let me know in the comments when you think that's it. I probably picked it up really faintly. What, I couldn't understand what it was saying, but it All sounded right. like a child. All right, so let's ask a question. <gasps> that was a man. Hello? Is anybody there? Is anybody here with us? Can you please come forward and talk to us? Yeah, we're getting, it almost sounds like a kid. Like last time we were here, we got a lot of kid uh, voices coming through. It's something like, sounding like a cry of a desperate mom or a woman who just, her kid had just died. Mm -hmm. If you or any of the spirits that were here with me last time, if you're still here, can you say yes or no? Well, can you say yes through the ghost box? Yeah. Did it say yeah? That's what that was, yeah. If you are the same spirit that manifested itself to me the other time I was here, full body, I want you to either show yourself to me or I want you to tell me the name you told me last time. What's the name you gave me last time I was here? Oh, Oh, <laughs> that just said boots. That just said boots. I told you I was not playing. I told you I was in line. Oh, 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 oh.
<laughs> Holy Look, mackerel. We're both getting major oh, chills goodness, here. Oh my goodness, look at my skin. Oh my God. <laughs> I, <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Boots. Now I can use your name in this cemetery. <gasps> I let this car pass. Oh I told my you I wasn't playing. I told you I wasn't playing. I told you. Look, I, have, that's I am really freaking lightheaded right now. Are you? Yeah. Don't oh. fall. Oh. What? Woo! What? Something tapped me on my freaking Something hand. You. I told you. This, oh. this cemetery will touch <laughs> yeah. you. It will mess with you and it will it would show you it's I am, to you. I am freezing right now. Are you? Yeah. Katie's freezing guys and we're in Nevada desert. It's June and it was 111 today. Yeah. 111 it's degrees. Warm. Right now, when we were driving out here, it was 95 degrees and she says she feels like she's freezing. Yeah. The name that just came through the ghost box was Boots. That is the same name of the apparition or the attachment that I think I have that's been following me around since the first time I came here. I am One of them. pretty freaking out right now. I'm, I got major chills and Katie got chills too because I had told her the story of Boots before we even came here and I told her I didn't want to... They're talking. They're, they're still going. They're, they're still going. going. And I told her I didn't want to use that name until the spirit gave it to us and the spirit just told us the name and it said Boots. <laughs> what did it say? It said three. I don't know if I caught that on camera but I asked how many spirits were around us and the ghost box said three. That's a female. That's a woman. That's a woman so far. So far we got a woman, a child, and a man. And the man we believe is Boots. The apparition has been following me or that has been attached to me and came home with me. I don't know if it's the same one, but according to this it's saying yes. Yeah, it said yes. Why did you follow me home? Bugs. There's no, no bugs. No, something. There's no bugs. Something just grew <laughs> in my head. There's no. Oh! What? <laughs> what? Hey! I said hey. Did you just grab my head and said hey after that? Something just touched me. That was over there. All right guys, so this is my first time doing this. I've never done this before, so I don't know if it's gonna work or if it even works at all. But what I'm going to do is I'm gonna try to see if maybe the entity that's been following me home or the boots will reflect itself through the mirror. So if you guys see his reflection through the mirror, please let us know in the comments. Let us know at what minute and what second it appeared so we can all check it out, all right? Like I said, this is the first time doing it. Keep an eye on the EMF detector in case it goes off and uh, we'll see if it works, all right? We're good right there? Yeah, look into all right. it. All right, if the spirit of whatever entity has been following me home is still around me, or any spirit at all, can you please show yourself through this mirror? I wanna see if you're here. You've shown yourself to me before. I want to know if you're here or if you're still around or if you're as strong as you seem to be. Something just smacked the camera. Something smacked the camera? Mm-hmm. I don't know if maybe anybody, if it'll reflect through here. Can you come close to me and touch this device right here with the light? That'll let me know that you're near me. Boots, if you're here, show yourself through this mirror. Did it again. It touched the camera again? Yeah. Is something pushing the camera away from me or mm -hmm. just kind of tapping it? Tapping it. Are you tapping the camera? Can you see the light there? I see. Didn't know. Your face is just lit up. All right. If you're tapping Katie's camera, come through the mirror. Walk this way. I want to see if I, we can see you. People want to know that you're real and I'm not just crazy. Do 
Mark on the glass or the mirror how many spirits of you, how many of you are there? It's it's pulling it from me. It's pulling the camera yeah. from you? I wonder if it's the spirit of a little kid. Cause they're I don't know, it's pulling like, like this. Like down? Yeah, but I'm like, I have it like locked in my tummy like this. Yeah. So it's not going anywhere, so but I can feel it. If it's pulling you down, I wonder if it's a little kid, a spirit of a little kid just kind of trying to pull it Maybe. You know? Could be. Someone's telling me, go over there. Just go over there. All right, so Katie seems to be getting pulled in that direction. So we're going to go in that direction and see if maybe... It's what? a bush. <laughs> it's a bush. <laughs> All right. So you're getting pulled in which direction? We need to go that way. All right, well, then let's go. Just hmm. that way. I'll record it while you're, you're walking. Go ahead. You're all right. All right, so something is attracting Katie in this direction, so we're gonna go and see uh, what it might be. All right, that was weird. We just had some random car just creep up on us and stood behind my car. Maybe it was checking out the powder we put on it or uh, maybe it was trying to see what we were doing. I don't know. That was just weird, kind of creepy. Kind of stuff you gotta be careful while you're out here in the desert. You never know what kind of crazy ass you're gonna Whoa, run into. Whoa, what happened? Just... What happened? Yo. What happened? Oh, something just like, like felt like it kicked me in my gut. Are you okay? Yeah. It kicked you? What do you mean? Like it hit you? Oh, yeah. And this is the direction that whatever it was pulling you yeah. in, right? You all right? Yeah. Why do I always get the pain? Where did it hit you? Oh, like right here. Did he leave you a mark? I doubt. I'm not showing my tummy. Oh, okay. I'll go. <laughs> no. No, you're red. I'm sunburnt. Okay. No. 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 All right. No, it felt like somebody like, like, did one of these. Like it pushed you. Yeah, like but it, it hurt. like it pushed your stomach hard. Yeah, but it hurt. All right, well, let's see if we can talk to whatever is here. I mean, you said you felt something dragging you in this direction, right? You all right? No, it's just, yeah. It couldn't, it couldn't leak from the, the Tommy knockers, right? That could, we're close to it. Because whatever's in there obviously does not like me. Yeah, well, it's, it is possible that, you know, these entities follow us. I mean, especially with, the locations we go to it could be that you know something's attached to us and it comes out when we do investigations oh, budge i really feel sick you feel nauseous yeah maybe we should walk away nah no i'm not gonna do it like that i just want to know who the heck Oh. Damn, must have hit you pretty hard. Oh, fudge. Dude, you know when you, like, get, like, one of those, like, the winds knocked out of you? Yeah. Was it that hard? Yeah. And now my, oh. Okay. Keep walking, let's go. I'm not, no. I ain't running. Well, she's a trooper. And oh my god, I am like, oh man. Let's bring it out. <laughs> oh, something just knocked me over. Whoa, whoa, what the hell? Dude, I don't something know just what pushed you. <laughs> oh, something just knocked me over. Whoa, whoa what the hell? Dude, I don't something know just what pushed you. <laughs> oh, something just knocked me over. Whoa, whoa what the hell? Dude, I don't something know just what pushed you. You saw that, I, right? I just saw the, as he pushed you. Okay. All right, whatever's here, you gotta stop messing with Katie. You gotta let her be. Just give me a minute to breathe, dude. Dude, something pushed you. I saw that. 
Something literally just pushed Katie really hard. I saw it and I think I got it on camera too. I hope you did. I think I'm pretty sure, 90% sure I caught it on camera that it pushed you out of the way. Now I'm getting pretty dizzy too. There's something right in this area where you were attracted oh, to. I gotta sit down. I gotta freaking sit down. Oh, All right. Man. Well, I'm looking at you. Is that a freaking human standing there, dude? That's I don't, you. I don't, Show yourself. I don't want to leave you, but. Go. I'll be all right. You sure here? Keep the okay. flashlight at least. I'll be good. All right. I just saw something standing over here. Oh, dude, major chills right here. Really bad. I just saw you standing here. Where are you? Oh my goodness, dude. I'm getting major chills right here, right? Shit. It's so cold here. It's You're really. You have to bleep that out. Dude, it's really, really, really cold here. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Can you see that? Yeah. Well, well not that. Yeah. No. <sighs> Dude, it's so cold right here. All right, so I saw an apparition just standing right here while Katie was doubled over back there. I came over here, and, and it's like so cold right here. It's really cold. All right. Whatever's here, show yourself. Make a sound. Make a sound. Make a noise. Let us know that you're here. Where are you standing? I like to bring the dowsing rods, but I can't because it's a little windy and it's gonna push them in different directions. And I don't wanna. But, uh, I don't want people to think that we're lying. But I don't have the ghost box on. I am yeah, I super sick right now. Super! Oh my! All right, all right. Let's let's go back to the truck and take a breather. No, I'm good. We don't. You need sure? To. Yeah. I'm not. They're not gonna push me like that. All right. No, well, no. you keep sick because I have a, I have something in there that might help you. What? A uh, rosary that was sent to me is already blessed and everything. I know. I it, it's. It, I can. It feels like they're taking my energy. That's why you need the rosary. And trying. Well, it doesn't feel bad. That's the thing. It just does it. If it's taking your energy, is bad. Uh. Not supposed to take your energy. Did you hear that? Oh, dude! You hear the scream? Who screamed? <laughs> you know what? I'm starting to think those aren't children. You know, Demari does not, or you know, though. You're not right, dude. You're not right. <laughs> Let's go get that rosary. Wait. <laughs> Guys, we just heard a really loud scream come from this part of the cemetery, but Katie is not right, so we're gonna go. I have some protection that a friend sent to me, a rosary. I have major chills as I'm, as I'm telling you this. And um, it was sent to help against uh, the attachments that I've, are on me, but I'm gonna give it there it is again. There is a scream again. I'm gonna give it. There it is again. There is a scream again. I'm gonna give it. There it is again. There is a scream again. Who is here with us? You have a bug on you. I got it. All right, guys. So we're gonna go to the truck, and we got. I gotta get that rosary for Katie because she's not right and. She's even blurring a lot of her words, so come this way. The most important thing when you do investigations is that everybody's okay, guys. So Katie's not feeling well, and whatever is here continues to attack her. And you know what? I didn't wear my stones. She usually carries protection. Don't step on that plot. No. She usually carries protection with her, and she didn't bring any this time. And I think maybe that's why he's attacking her as hard. Did you see that? I freaking Wait, what hope. did you see? What you, did you see? <laughs> I me. saw something running right there. Yes. Just right there. Yes, right by our mask. mirrors. Right by oh. our mirrors. I told you this is where, where are you going? Don't run, dude. Don't run. Nothing. 
Let's see. There is. There's scratches. But I can't tell what it is. Right here. There's some here too. There's some scratches here. I didn't see those. Is there anything on the other side? No, I didn't see anything. Nothing. All right. So let's grab our stuff. So maybe we should call it a night if it's attacking you this hard. What I'm not think? afraid. It doesn't scare it's me. It's not about being me. afraid, dude, but it's going to attach you. No, it needs to leave me the fuck alone. It's what it's got to do. We'll take care of it in a minute. Let's go. All right, guys. So I have to give this rosary to Katie. It's already been blessed by one of my friends um, to help with whatever had been following me home, but she's getting attacked pretty hard, so I'm going to give it to her so she can wear it. And hopefully whatever's here will leave her alone. Did you? Huh? Not get there? We did. We got all of it. All right, you guys, let me know. You guys let me know what you think about that. That's like a fresh area, it looks like. And we were pouring, we were pouring powder all over here. I don't see nothing up front, do you? No, except for just that spot. I don't remember that spot. That spot maybe right there, maybe. There's no powder there? Not really. I mean, there is, but you can see where I just put a mark. Yeah. Right here and here. All right, well. We might have to cut this investigation a little short only because uh, we're getting attacked pretty hard. So what do you think? You think it's haunted or no? Mm -hmm. I would have to say yeah. You think so? Just for the simple fact that it actually reminded me of the Tommyknocker mine because of the simple fact that it fucking hit me. Yeah. Whatever's in this area doesn't... I don't think it likes you very much. I don't think so <laughs> And it's always in this area where you get attacked. Yeah. Well, I mean, in this where, town. Well, yeah. Yeah, guys, so... Uh, yeah, guys, so... Um, you be the judge. We show you the evidence. We show you all the manifestations that we saw. I personally am going to call this place haunted. And whatever's here, boots... If you're still here, you have to stay here. You're not welcome to follow me home anymore. Stay here. I hope it listens, man. 